Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. So today, update on my new racket journey. I know a lot of you are like, where are you at with that? <laughs> Haven't seen you with a new racket yet, uh, especially my man, Kevin. And I was like, dude, you know, you know, things like this take some time. Stay tuned. All right, so sponsoring my coffee of the day is my man, Carl. Carl Bookbinder from stringing.com. Oh, my man, thank you, Carl. Uh, Carl, I sent my rackets to Carl a while back, and he did some miracle string jobs on my rackets and Goo's racket, and we were like, oh, blown away. So uh, Carl wanted to just thank me for doing the video and bought me a coffee today. Um, Thanks, Carl. Here's to you. Keep up the good work. I've had a lot. I've heard a lot of you actually comment to me saying how professional he was and how great those string jobs turned out. So if you want to check them out. It's stringing.com. Um, and uh, Carl, appreciate the coffee. If you want to sponsor my morning cup of joe, my morning brew, or you just want to roast me, network is buy me a coffee dot com forward slash tennis spin thank you in advance all right just thinking about, about being roasted here okay i know guys i'm getting to it you know because it's not easy changing rackets as you guys know and uh you know so i got the next step two in my uh, journey is adding weight so i figured out that these three are are still in the running after hitting with it for a while. Now, I wanted to add weight, and I actually added a pretty significant amount of weight to some of these. As you can see, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's about eight grommet holes long on both sides, both sides and on both sides, right? This is where I like to start. I tell people six on their own, but I like eight because I want to feel my head and just, you know, see how it drives through. Yeah. Okay. So I did the same with the uh, Selenko. Right. And I did a little VT to the Fury. It's hard to see black on black there. So, but pretty much same amount of weight, all three. Next thing to do, go out, play with it, with the weight for a little bit. So this journey ain't an overnight journey. You know, I, some people are super easy when they walk on this journey. They just kind of walk into the store and it's like, I'll take that one. Yeah, I know. I'm kind of too touchy-feely that way. I got to like, you know, feel it. You know, it's all about feel. Okay. Let's see if Rob's available to for my next test. See you on the court. All right, guys. So on the court with my hitting partner, Coach Rob, we got the weighted up three rackets that I'm considering changing to and let's see how it goes.
right, so we just got through. Um, I kind of have an idea of what I like today with the weights. So I did add weight to all of these, Coach Rob, yep. and I let Coach Rob try them himself. Um, Coach Rob, what did you, what do you think I played with better out of the three today? Uh, I think you hit pretty well with the with this one, uh, the Fury, and then the Dunlop. 300G, uh, or what is it, Dunlop, 300, 300. Tour, uh, and then uh, it kind of fell off a little bit when you went to the blackout. Mm. I don't okay. know if it was because you were dressed in black, or <laughs> exactly what, but I don't think I didn't hit particularly well with this one either, so it might have just been the grip, or I was just turning in my hand a little bit, or I wasn't watching the ball as well. Um, when I was hitting with them, I kind of liked this one a little bit more than I did this one. This one was off um, at the bottom of our list, but got it. So you think that I played best with this one? I thought you were a little bit better than this one, and then this one, and then down to the blackout. Got it. So I'm seeing the same thing. Like I've been on these for a couple weeks now since the last review. I added the weights on, and I've I've hit um, eh, two weeks already, and I kind of feel the same way as coach Rob it's pretty consistent that this one seems to be slightly ahead and then comes this one and then th I gotta tweak this one somehow um you mean over grip? yeah I don't do over grips remember oh sorry <laughs> I, maybe I put my head grip on this one but um it's uh yeah, I'm not sure what's going on, but for some reason, as you guys were saying, I was hitting good with the Fury stock, Coach um, Coach Goo too, even Coach Chris said this this Arma Pro um, seemed to be the best, and even you said it was the best for me, even though I didn't feel that way in that first test before the weights, but the weights are definitely doing something positive for this racket for me. It actually is changing my mind on this one. And it definitely stabilizes Dunlop. As Coach Rob was saying, like he seemed to like this one himself when I added the weight on. Right, I like this one. I felt like there was a pretty big sweet spot on it. Maybe it got a little bit bigger with the with the weight, uh, but I felt like I was hitting it pretty clean most, most hits. Um, and even the ones I hit a little off center still felt not as bad as like when I hit went off center with the, the blackout, um, I think maybe I just like this grip size a little bit more. Oh. Um, so, got it. And then I, I need to do something with the Selenko blackout. I think I think the original one I tried that I actually liked was the extended version. So I may change this one for an extended version just to see because I remember um, the half inch longer I did like a little more. So I may swap this out on the next go around when I add more weight to the these rackets. All right, so the journey continues, guys. It's You guys know it's never easy to switch. And when you have options, ugh, might make it harder sometimes. So journey continues. I want to thank my man, Coach Rob, for always being there for me and hanging out with me today. Uh, thank you, Coach Rob. Very well. Guys, to be continued, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Hey, Coach Rob, how are you? I'm good. How you doing, Harry? Eh, you know, I had a pretty tough week. A lot of rackets. Oh, man, I don't even know what day it is. A lot of dumb questions. Oh, you wouldn't believe it. <laughs> but I'm so glad to have you out here today with me. Yeah, looking forward to hitting. Yeah, you wouldn't believe how hard it is for me to find a game. Wow, that's surprising. Well, that's why I have you, Coach <laughs> <laughs> So if you're having problems looking for a game, looking for a coach, looking for somebody to play with, try out playyourcourt.com. They'll have tennis buddies for you, matches buddies for you that match well with you. If you need your very own coach, Rob, they'll have that person for you too. And it's playyourcourt.com dot com forward slash tennis spin for half off link is below let's get going coach Rob. let's do it